taught business and technical writing for three decades in almost half the Fortune 500 corporations, I've literally been reading your mail. Well, okay, maybe not your mail, but I've read and discussed hundreds of thousands, if not millions, of emails, letters, proposals, and reports with both writers and recipients to discover their intentions and the results. And in that process, I found some culprits that create a lack of clarity and reflect weak thinking on the page and on the screen. Here are my top 10. The once upon a time format. Starting at the beginning of a situation and going to the end works for a bedtime story, a TV sitcom, TV sitcom and a joke, but not for emails and letters and proposals. In fact, for 99 out of 100 business documents, you should make your bottom line your opening line. The second big mistake. So what writing? When you receive these documents, your response is typically, so what do you want me to do? Think, believe, approve, consider, buy. These documents represent no clear summary or conclusion. Instead, they just are a collection of information. A third common mistake. No context. The writer just assumes that the reader knows far more about a situation than they do. Consequently, they jump into the details of a situation without really identifying people or their purpose. A fourth common mistake. Irrelevant details. Extraneous details just cloud the central issue. They bury key points and they confuse readers about really the necessary action. A fifth common writing mistake, unclear actions. Whatever the writer assumes to be obvious and implied is just often not obvious to other people. 